I entirely forgot that I turned I I removed all my audio sources for one thing I did work earlier. Hold on. Audio sources that are live again. Just not actually streaming yet. It's still it's still good, it's still going. I just jinxed myself, watch. <laughs> I mean, that's not how that works because it's just a superstition, but okay. I mean, it has happened a few times. Where I said, it's, hey, this is working, and it immediately dies. It's called a coincidence. It's called, let me have fun. It's not fun if it makes your shit stop working. Your mom's a coincidence. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's see. It's pronounced coinky I'm gonna coinky let it go for like three minutes. Or you know what? It usually dies when I start the game up, so let's just move let's move to the game. Coinky dink. It usually dies when I start the game. Uh I'm gonna create a session. I'm also recording, just, uh, so if this doesn't work, guys, uh, I'm just gonna upload the VOD. Uh, oh, oh. Uh, stream information. Not that one, hold on. I need three uh, stream you channels. Shouldn't prepare before you head down to the Rotten Vale? Shouldn't we prepare before you head down to the Rotten Vale? The Rotten Vale only really contains Odokaron. Uh, I forgot the Valhazak, that's his name. Okay, sure. I, I forgot Spoilers! That. My god, Ezreal. I'm just joking. It's not. The game is like eight years old. I think six. You know, you know what's funny? People um, are going back to this game rather than Rise. Well, yeah, because it's because um, mainly because it's similar to how wild it's gonna be, and people are excited about that. Yeah, but and also people just I think people just like this game more than Rise, and I'm one of those people. Rise is good, but like it's kind of just meh. It's too easy, in my opinion. This game's easy, too. And then, once you know what you're doing, yes, it is. Like, this game is also kind of easy. It's not... It, I mean, like, okay. It's easy if you've played other Monster Hunters. If you've never played a Monster Hunter, this game's not easy. <laughs> but, yeah. Also, some extra bullshit that it I won't seems, get into on stream about, about it as well. It seems to be okay. My, my, my Twitch still says Minecraft. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is totally this Minecraft. This is definitely Minecraft. It's actually the Minecraft movie game. Exactly. They already released it before... <laughs> Before they even else. thought of it. Before they even knew what the movie was. I am Steve. Like, people have been making memes about that. It's like, okay, how are they going to do the zombie then? Is it just going to be Jack Black with his skin painted green? <laughs> that, <laughs> I, that's actually hilarious. I mean... It's because they're basing it off of how half of the mob in Minecraft were built. Uh, like, that's not even a joke. That The zombie is literally just a Steve model with a different color. I know that. People were also saying that they were just going to have Steve have, like, artificially two extra heads for the wither. <laughs>
Like, if they actually wanted to make the Minecraft movie good, they, they could should, do a little bit They should not make it live action. The, the though, movie would be good if it was animated. Though the thing is, right, there's already theories going on that maybe it's intentionally like this to try and copy the whole ugly Sonic fiasco. I completely doubt it. I, this is this is the movie. I mean, the literal movie's director said, I do not want to have another ugly Sonic fiasco. Then, then the animate it. Kill me. Then animate it. The movie's not going to look good if it's live action. But they, notice they, how you know Sonic be, 1... You know what would be cool, actually? If it if the movie was made in, like, actual Minecraft. That'd be sick. That would require a lot of custom mods, then. Yeah, but still. That'd be so cool. True. If they that made it... Be. If they actually made it in Minecraft. Yeah, because... Realistically, like, look at, for instance, uh, what is it, Five Nights at, at, at Cave? I, I, I don't know, My Nights at Freddy's, which is at Burnham and Caveman, uh, fan series of FNAF. That was made completely in Minecraft, and it was really good, actually. Yes, I am old like that. That shit was back in 2015. <laughs> Bro, I'm I'm old at this point too. God, I remember when Ant Venom was like also reviewing Minecraft mods back in one point two point five. I'm also Holy... I'm sitting in the lobby, by the way. Oh, I forgot to join. Hold on. Yeah, it's fine. I'm spreading my stream around, anyways. I mean, if it's any consolation, kind of like with the FNAF movie, they do actually have Minecraft YouTubers, at least the ones that weren't cancelled yet, on the actual set. Of course they do. Like, Dan TDM was there. At least I mean, that's all I really know who was there, but that's about it. It's not It's not going to be good because Tetanite Blade isn't in it. They made it too late. Yeah... I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if the idea that it's supposed to be a tribute to Technoblade... If I don't see a single Techno Technoblade reference in that movie, it's it's trash. Yeah. I, I better see I, I better see a pig with a crown. I better see, like, a, a, a village that has a statue of Technoblade in there being heroic. I mean, a pig with a crown would be good enough. They, they um... They they made that a reference on the actual Minecraft before. Like on the loading thing. Yeah. And then they got rid of it for some reason. Uh didn't they bring it back after the news happened? I have no idea. I, I my launcher won't open for some reason. <laughs> like it won't work. <laughs> I can only play vanilla Minecraft through mod runs. What what happened? I don't know, it just won't open. I keep I keep clicking the launcher and it just won't turn on. Out of I mean I, 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 I mean I I rarely play vanilla Minecraft anyways, but still. <laughs> uh, that's one thing that I wish Microsoft wasn't so afraid to do. Actually change the game. I remember when Minecraft didn't have a hunger bar. I mean, what yeah. else do you want them to add? A thirst bar? Um, what they can do is completely overhaul some mechanics that Mojang said they would overhaul years ago. Hoping, I'm really hoping this works out because I want to stream Persona 4, uh, Persona 3. Don't you mean Persona 4 minus 1? <sighs> I'm ignoring that. Point that you actually get the reference. <laughs> no, the, but seriously, I, I do, I do want to get back into streaming again. It's just, it's hard at this point. Yeah, interwebs and all. 
I'm not, I'm not connected to the actual thing. I'm connected to the extender. So let's see how this works. I mean, what the hell? Why did the game say you're just in a group named Payday 2? That's, um... That's like one of the, the groups that you can be in. I am in my I own just, group I just that picked, I made. I literally just picked the game, honestly. Oh, I'm in my oh, own group that I made you. like second, eight years ago. Ugh, alright. When did I... Cause I made that group like the same year I owned Steam. That was back in like 2010 or something. <clears throat> Watch, the second gameplay actually happens. <laughs> the stream's gonna die. I mean, no, I'm also dynamic wrong. bit rate. When the game starts moving faster, so does your our computer. And I'm, so does I'm gonna attack. post it on Blue Sky too because of why not? What the heck was that? <laughs> Thank you. If you would like to make a donation, computer, stop. <laughs> Oh, I was like, who the hell is talking? <laughs> I completely forgot that there's a wake word. What? Compu computer. I literally said that your your computer would have a heart attack. And it started saying, here's what a heart attack is. I think blue sky is broken, so I'm not going to try. I'm going to turn your stream on the tablet. This is what will give my internet a heart attack. <laughs> be sure not to be too close to a microwave oven. Someone toasting a burrito will kill it. Oh, I gotta type in your long ass username. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Freaking one of your old ass videos, Ezreal plays hand snowflakes, candle, tear, freaking, a freaking wingding thing just popped up eight years ago. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that was one of us. Don't play Undertale. I need to play that again, actually, and then play Deltarune again, because I didn't Dude, exactly I play Dude, I want to play Undertale. I want to play Undertale again at some point. Are you in the lobby? Yeah. Okay. I have been for like the past 20 minutes. I want to play Undertale again. Because I haven't played it in years. Okay, we have to speak to the third fleet master. Where is that guy? Uh, in the airship thingy. Do I not have drank bombs? World map. Yes. I guess I don't yes. have track bombs. I'm not bringing traps then. Everything seems to be okay. I'm waiting at the third fleet master. I think I was her last time. Yeah. I know we have him here too. Now is the time. Just tell me when you're in her dialogue. I'm in the dialogue. I'm, in, uh, yeah. I'm ready, in her dialogue. Ready to descend into the rotten veil. The part. Sure. Right. First, we need to look for a place to touch down. Once we reach our destination, you mu you may depart and make camp preparations. Then it's back to the usual order of business: flying Zora, Zora Magnet Rose to a uh, trail. That's actually, that's hard to say in an actual conversation when we're not making fun of him. Uh, now I want you to pay uh, close attention. While you're down there, think long and hard. What is the Rotten Veil? Vale? How does it connect to the Coral Highlands? <laughs> well then, off we go. I was in Autumn's stream earlier, by the way, and apparently one of his... Viewers and, uh, one of his viewers and, uh, I guess friends is, uh, <laughs> Fatalis. <laughs> yeah, uh, Fatalis is actually a cool guy. He's friends <laughs> with the guy who killed me over and over. 
He's friends with the guy that we exploded it. Well, he exploded in specifically Monster Hunter Stories 2. Bro, I'm still loading. Bro, I'm already in the cutscene. I know, I can see. I'm I'm still loading. <laughs> I'm still loading. Personally, I think Monster Hunter World's like whole theming behind why the hunters are there and all the areas are a little better than Rises. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I just now started the cutscene. <laughs> oh. What happened? Oh, hey, I forgot he was a thing. Oh, the great Juras? Hey. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he's really easy. You Did you know his tail can come yeah. off? Yes, I kept doing that on accident oh. when I was fighting him the first time. <laughs> Very well. I didn't know that. I didn't know that until I was grinding his parts. But anyways, you were saying about world? I think that the, the theming up behind all the areas is a little bit more, I guess, impactful than in Rise. Because in Rise, it's just kind of there, you're just a ninja, well done. Here, it's supposed to showcase the circle of life. Uh, world is more realistic, and I think Rise was more, like, arcadey. Yeah, but again, circle of life. The, the, Monster they Hunter even, the, they Mon even outrun that when you get to the Guiding Hunter. Lands. Monster Hunter kind of has, like, the Fallout kind of pattern. <laughs> Where, or I guess the Pokemon pattern, where they make a new generation, and then with that generation, they make a brand new game. Like, with Fallout 3, they made Fallout New Vegas with the same engine. And then with, uh, with Pokemon, they usually make a new generation, then a remake. They, they basically do the same thing with, with Monster Hunter. So, like, this is 5th gen. And Rise is also 5th gen, and Wilds is considered 6th uh, gen. Hmm. So when it gets to 8th gen, rem uh, expect this game to start sucking. When it gets to 8th gen, prepare for a game that has next to no frames and all the amount of pop-in. I'm in the, uh, the area, so we can go. Oh, I accidentally walked forward, help. Oh, cutscene. Cutscene, job of the hut scene. The Rotten Veil vale is really cool, but once you go deeper down, it's not that fun. Oh, there goes Obvious. Yeah, I was gonna say, you sound like a robot now. Oh, oh yeah. hold on. <laughs> oh. Hmm. I'm. Probably not going to be too too coherent because I'm so tired. Even though I took a nap. Yeah, it it just it's it's gone. Well, return from expedition. What are you doing? Why are you leaving? So that we can so that we can join the the thing together. We if can't. We can do that. Yes, you can. When you see the cutscene. No, there's multiple cutscenes. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm wait, not, I'm not streaming. I'm just, re wait, I'm just gonna record. There is. Yes, we have to do this alone. Oh. Also, I, I'm, I'm not streaming. I'm just recording. Which sucks. Because I want to stream, but my internet literally won't let me. So just yeah. give me a, just just give me a minute. Gala. I'm unpausing my recording. So like yeah, like unless I get my own internet or I like wire down a Ethernet cable down there to plug into the thing, which they're not gonna allow me to do, obviously. Uh I just can't stream anymore. Or they get better internet at some point. Which, randomly. it's not gonna happen because everyone thinks that this internet is better. 
Which it clearly isn't. They only they oh. only think it's better because one of the towers for the previous thing we we had one of those went down and it was terrible for for like three days. So they only think it's better because it's not like choppy like it was before for like a few days. I entirely forgot to eat. Oh yeah, so did I. Well, Brotobon, uh, you're gonna you're gonna kick my ass. Yeah, uh, I'll be right back, hey, Rotobon. I'm gonna go home. <laughs> oh God, Rotobon, please. Watch yourself. Hold Peace. on, buddy. I'll be back. I'm gonna go eat. Proceed with caution. I need to get I better armor. I entirely forgot how freaking powerful his armor is. I need I need to get better armor, cause I still have a uh, Anjaneth. Although I think Anjaneth armor at this point is like the best Nothing you can, can get us. until like until we beat like better monsters down here. Um, camera, Ca camera, Ca camera, camera hunter. There has to be something I can do to make my internet better, or at least my or at least my connection to my computer. There has to be something I can do. I mean, have you tried uh, like extending the antenna for your Wi-Fi on my you computer? Can... Yes, you can. You can. You can tinfoil. Actually, how many do I have? I think I'm. Is there a thing of the antennas going bad? Uh, I am not sure. What about, because I think I have like an antenna adapter that I used to use for my laptop. I'm not what sure if, if I, that what works if I, with PC. What if I put that in my computer so that it has four antennas? <laughs> I'm not sure that works. I have to try something. Give me that tail. Oh, did I just break your tail? No, I didn't. I exploded into your tail. Why did you not take damage? Bad choice of words. Oh, I didn't even restock. I somehow still have potions though. Give me this tail. Oh, you can't target the tail. Okay, that was baloney. Haha, there we go. I think I think marrow is is Rodobon's equivalent to a, a plate, so that might be good.
Yeah, but still, uh, there's gotta be something I can do to up my connection. There probably is, but I just don't know about it. I mean, even my, like, switch stays on t two bars every now and then. But that's the switch. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. The switch isn't exactly the most powerful. It also is a really out of date wireless antenna the switch is using. I. What? Yeah, Beta Kendra 1 is kind of useless. It's. Evade Extender is only good if you're bad at dodging. Like, if you're not that bad at dodging, you don't need it. But again, it does. At oh, I am, least, I am at I, orange. If I remember correctly, it does give you iframes when you roll. Yeah, it extends your your evade. That's that's the name of the skill. Broke your other leg. Oh, he's already limping. Oh, that was nice. I see why you play longsword a lot, man. Yeah, you get to become your favorite anime character. I Name might me. use longsword in, in, in wild, honestly. Either long sword. I've been using great sword a lot too. You can either be Ichigo or God. No in between. Oh come on! I wonder if you can sound pod him uh, or sonic pod him out of the ground when he's getting his bones back. On this episode of Mythbusters. Actually, speaking of myths, uh, apparently people are trying to figure out whether Devil Joe really eats his own tail or not. Because uh, apparently that's like a that's a myth that's been going around since he's been introduced, yet no one has actually seen it happen. So people, I mean, people just assume that it's fake. I mean, if it was real, the data management would have already heard something about it. Because when a game is popular, people will try to get everything out of it by hacking it. Get your ass back here, Rotobon. Hello. I don't have any more healing. Go back to the camp. I mean, even if you even if you die, it's not gonna really matter because it's just an expedition.
I already accidentally cut off a tail, so I don't really care. Oh, come on! And Leon has just been screwing him up as well. That's a powerful type of slitting around us. Bro, the, 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 okay. According to my research, Rotobomb doesn't actually exist yet until it's scooped and deep. I just flat out don't have any potions at all anymore. Hold on. You can just buy some. I'm in the mission still. phone restarts. It, it does that every now and then. I have no idea why. Did, 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 is your phone exploding? Maybe? I don't know. Is it okay? Does it require assistance? It's fine. Attack up middle. No, stop carving the Hornetar! I... Huh? I can do that to him twice? Hey, I got him! Let's go. That's 
a slinger thorn. That's a that's a thorn pod. Powerful type of slinger ammo. <laughs> We're also um getting close to high rank, by the way. Ow. Ah, uh, he he turned oh my the God. on me. Hope. Uh, wait. There... Huh? Why is this here? What? I I found a random hole that I accidentally crawled into. It's a shortcut or a hidden passage or something. I don't know. Yeah, but like I didn't know that was even there. Oh, also. Uh, it's cool that when you look at the map, you can see, uh, the Delameter head on the map. The what? The Delameter head. What's the Delameter? Uh, it's apparently the biggest monster in the entire series. Oh yeah, speaking of which, people want to see Bahamut from Final Fantasy in Wilds. You know, the monster that is bigger than an entire planet. I don't think we're getting that. I want to see Delameter in Wilds. Because that'd be really cool. But I want to see a lot of old... Uh, I want to see a lot of old... Pot. Monsters. In Wilds. That we haven't seen in years. Okay, you're dead. I mean, people want to see some really unreasonably sized monsters in the wild. People want us to be able to hunt the... I forget exactly what they're called. But it's like the two giant monster things that make up the world uh, itself in Daniel Blade Chronicles. Vapor stuff. Don't breathe it in or your health will drop. The Be careful not Mechon? To I forgot yeah, what they're that, called. Because one, one was, was mechanical, one was organic, if I remember correctly. I mean, we have seen some really giant monsters. Like, open your map real quick and go to, like, the the bottom Hold uh, on, layer. I'm being attacked by giant mosquitoes. Mosquitoes killed. Yeah, just open your map and go to, like, the very bottom. And you see, like, literally, there's, like, a, there's a giant snake head. That's a delameter. Like, I can look uh, up how big this thing is real quick. Uh, in the Rotten Vale? Yeah. On the map. Hold on, I'm still okay. I'm still being attacked by Hornetar. Hold on. Delameter Monster Hunter size. Delameter, uh, is over 440 meters long. Yeah. I mean, it's not that bad. He's giant. He's the biggest monster in the series. Yeah, but also 440 meters. Is... Dude, like, compared to Zora Magdaros, like, the Lameter compared to Zora Magdaros, the, uh, Zora Magdaros is a freaking baby. What you see, um... Yo, I'm gonna fuck you... up. I'm gonna fuck up this Juros. Hold on. Have you heard of the worms from Doom? That would be cool if they just decided to do a Doom cough over it. I'm killing this, uh... The, uh, Great Juros. I'm going to see if I can capture mine because I had a thing a while back where I would always do one capture, one kill. And if I remember correctly, last time I fought a great hero, I, I killed it, so. 
I'm gonna capture it if I have materials to- If I don't, it dies tonight. I don't have any Trank Bomb, so it dies. I don't need to do what yet? No, it's dead. It's dead. <laughs> it's dead. dead. God, that's, that's like on the order of magnitude of like war times. It's like, oh, do we have the ability to capture it? No, poor it dies tonight. <laughs> Sorry. I mean, that's just Monster Hunter, actually. Can we capture it? No, then it dies. Hey, it's not a war time, it's the first time. We need to learn everything about this monster by killing it. Apparently, our researchers are kind of stupid and don't exactly know how to study a monster when it's there's alive. A new, there's a new monster? Kill everything that's not involved with it. <laughs> this is essentially Monster Hunter. Like, we have killed everything but Zora Magdaros. And even then, we are so fascinated with Zora Magdaros as to why it's doing the Elder Crossing and everything. And we just had to kill it anyway. Oh, let's go! Hey, there we go. There's go there goes that tail. Also, explain why it's so annoying to get Jiros Fangs. Not even great Jiros Fangs, just regular Jiros Fangs. It's a little old thing called RNG. Desire Sensor is what it's called for Monster Hunter. Well, I always called it RNG because that's what children would call it. Look, man, I think he's already about to die. A flu beam isn't even that bad. It is. It doesn't it... do that much damage over time. Yeah, but it halves your health over time. Remember that? Uh, wasn't that the upgraded version that no, Rock and Rock gave No, no. If you stay in the effluvium for too long, it literally halves your health. Or if you just get hit by infected uh, monsters. Like, it, like, if you just keep getting hit by effluviated monsters, they, they can half your health. That's why you need to get armor that ha oh my god. I mean that that's why you have to get armor that either negates it or just keep null berries down here. Or you use a cleansing pod. That too, but it's easier just to have null berries. Or have armor. I'll, I'll null your berries. <sighs> There's this one joke. Again. <laughs> I only made that one. I only made the thing once. What the? Fuck? Yeah, but you you're gonna yeah, make it, you're gonna you're gonna make it like ten more times within the next hour. No, I am not. The only other joke I made this entire time was a war crime joke. Encoding overload, my ass. Wait, what? OBS is on encoding overload. Oh yeah, no, that just means that your computer is not powerful enough. Good, my, my computer is just dying. I do want to upgrade at some point, but I don't have the money. Yeah, that's the thing about just PCs in general. They be expensive for no reason. They're expensive because the parts are expensive. And the parts are expensive for no reason. Like no joke, I think they're, they're video expensive that, that... because they're hard to make. Not all the time. 
Then you make a PC and, from scratch Nvidia, entirely. Nvidia literally said we charge as much as we want because we can. <laughs> Ah, I forgot these idiots do fucking paralysis. Hold on. Oh yeah, great. Yeah, Jeros does paralysis. Oops. I'm sorry. Did this? Did this man just the people elbow me? Great Jeros? Oh, yeah, he just gave me the people to elbow. What is that again? I, I forgot. It's a, rest, it's a wrestling move. No, like, what what is the move? Uh, he just literally shouldered me. Which is the closest thing you can get to a quadrupedal creature's elbow. Hey! Let's go. Uh, Give me those cards. Okay, yeah, you know what? That's fair. What happened? I was I was actually like visibly annoying Great Jiro because I kept bouncing. I'm going back to the research base. Like, unironically, I'm pretty sure Great Jiro was like. Man, this dude is just bouncing. Why do we even care anymore? Uh, uh, oh, oh. Huh? It's you two. Why are you giving um, me tutorials on what to do when my house is low? Use higher. I'm, <laughs> I'm looking up how, how to make my Wi-Fi stronger despite distance. And some, someone says use higher number, number channels. I don't know how to do that. That configuration fleet. with the router you itself, so that's not really useful. Alive. Hang on. She must be the one who saved us. Oh my gosh, thank you. Thank you. Just glad you're still in one piece. Fifth Fleet, am I right? What are you doing out here? Actually... Create a mesh system using a Wi-Fi hmm. extender. Hmm. This is from Zora. We Magiros. have an extender. It's just not I'll in my room. <laughs> I've spent years delving into this valley's secrets, and I'm starting to understand a thing or two. <sighs> now it's your turn. Learn all emotional the damage. Next time we meet. Okay, we can, can you not? Notes. Sound good? Yes. We're on the job. Sir, sirs. Oh yeah. my god, please stop paralyzing me. There. I can now carve in peace. Waiting for you at the dialogue, by the way. Hold on, I haven't actually killed my Jiros yet because they kept getting paralyzed. I thought you were carving. I was carving its tail. Oh. Alright. How am I back? I was at. What? Well, is its underbelly just that strong or something? Link speed, 72 megabytes. Network fan, 2.4. They were saying like five. Well, five is faster, but it can't really go through walls too well and 
2.4 is a little slower, but it can go through walls, like, better than everything. Return from expedition, yes. 2.4 is slower, but better distance and wall penetration. 2.5 is good and fast, but lacks distance. That's what, yeah, that's what they're saying. I would connect mobile devices to 2.4 if 5 is giving you grief. That's what they're saying. That is assuming, of course, you can... You'd have I to, can't. Like, I can't touch that thing. They won't let me. No, like you'd have to have multiple networks and you just connect to the two point four one. Yeah, no, I don't think there's anything I can really do. So I, I'm, I'm just... It's either I get my own thing, or I'm just fucked. And I can't stream. What if I just what if I just bought my own Wi-Fi without telling them? Honestly. I mean I highly doubt your family even knows anything about technology, so they probably not even care. No, they it's would just, they uh, would they would probably care that like I spent money on the Wi Fi. They're gonna be like, Why'd you buy why did you buy this? We already have Wi Fi. They're gonna make they're gonna talk about some stupid shit. I already know they are. Uh -huh. Well, e even e even though me buying my own Wi-Fi would be somewhat beneficial because it would it would teach me how to pay for my own Wi-Fi. That plus also they kind of can't get pissy at you for that because you're the one who bought it. <laughs> also, I'm at the third fleet master dialogue now. All right. Hmm. No sign of Zora Magdaros's trail. Disappointing. I know. I, that's, what, that's, what I, that's what I end up doing. I suggest you descend further. The effluvium levels would be more toxic, but that's not going to be a problem now, is it? <laughs> Just say the word when you're ready. You should prepare before going down to the bottom of the Rotten Vale. There might not be any turning back once we're there. You should prepare. Shut up. She kind of sounds like a Karen. Greetings. No one likes her. <laughs> also, oh, now, hey. now we have Tail Rider. I forgot how Tail Raiders work. Uh, how do I get your Palicos on the thing? I don't know if you can. You can, because I remember that, uh, that, that, like, Mark would use mine and the, the, I'd use Mark. I have, I don't know if you, I, I have no idea. It might not be possible to do in high rank. That might be a master rank thing. Or we just don't know many people, because I think, I think Leon was there. Well, I don't see anything at all for you. I just see Casey's Explorers, and I don't know a Casey. I, I, it's, it's most likely just an AI. Is 
Is there a thing I can do with OBS to make it better? You can decrease the bit rate. Will that make it to that? Hmm. Yeah, it should put less stress on the signal, just the only issue is that it'll be lower quality. Because I'm at 3,000. What if I go down to 2,000? I'm already recording, but this will just... Alright, let's just, let's just see. Like, what, what are you, are you going to be streaming at 1080p 60fps or 1080p 30fps? I'm at 60. I, I lowered, I lowered the bitrate down to 2000. So the recommended bitrate for 1080p 60 is 24,000. Well, I'm at 2000. <laughs> oh no, 2400. Not, not, look, okay, brain. I'm just gonna stick with 2000, see how that goes. Because I already don't think this will work. But let's see. If this, if this ends up working though, I will probably just stream like this. Uh, no, there it goes. Jeez, that means that your internet is so exploded that it's not even worth it. So yeah, I just, I just can't stream. My streaming stuff is just gone. Well. And I also said you left the online session. Uh, huh? What if I, I'm gonna, fuck it, I'm gonna go down all the way to like 1,000. Bitrate 1,000, let's try it. Let's see. I'm at 1,000 bitrate. Let's see how bad it is. It's probably not even like eligible for a viewing now. Oh, it is. It'll just be buffering like a motherfucker. Yeah, in connection to session have been lost. Continuing in offline mode. Let's see what let's see what my stream looks like. It's gonna look like hot garbage. What does it look like? Come on, show, show gameplay. <coughs> oh. oh my god, the pixels. I mean, you don't sound like you're exploding now. I'm just gonna try and test a few things. What if I went to 1500? That's what I used to go to. Or, you know what? 175. Let's see. Like, what is the maximum upload rate of your Wi-Fi currently? How do I find that? Go to fast.com. And then click on more info. Fast.com? Yes. Where's more info? Or just, just yeah, it's like bottom right, I think. Hold on, let me. I forgot. Bottom what right I, says powered by know. Netflix. <laughs> oh, right there we go. Internet speed twenty five mega uh, twenty five megabytes uh, per second. Uh, latency zero unloaded zero meg uh, zero milliseconds loaded five eighty one. What about upload speed, which is the right of that? 22. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure... 
It okay, seems so to 1, be okay. 000... It seems to be okay with one seventy-five. Yeah, one seventy-five is fine because that's kilobit per second and internet measured in megabit per second. One seventy-five. Well, one thousand seven hundred kilobits per second is one point seven megabit per second. That's within the bandwidth range, so that should be fine. Anything over twenty-two will screw you over. But I was just at two thousand. Yeah, well, you have it's called overhead 200 extra megabits per second or kilobit per second so or whatever. So 175 is gonna be should be that. okay. Yes, I'm going you might to, be I, able I'm gonna trust to you. Get away with a little. I'm, I'm all, should be, did you rejoin? I forgot to do that. It should be, but I'm also not entirely sure of your specific network. Uh, traffic or anything, so I'm not entirely sure a hundred percent if it is. I mean, I think the only other person using internet is my mom downstairs. And it's most likely going to just be for regular computing or just browsing the internet. They're just, so they're, just be fine. they're just watching TV with it, I think. Oh, then you'd have to fight against that, which I'm not entirely sure what exactly the download so, but then again it should be full duplex so, so granted so what's using wi-fi is monster hunter obs their tv and also my tablet which is watching your stream so so far things have been okay the yeah, other, point, the, the other pre five should be the max. So. The other previous times, it, it it broke immediately. So, yeah, so one, one point seven five should be fine. I'm just gonna say that this is working okay so far. Okay, I gotta delete the. The previous things, because the stream has been like pinged all those times that I've tested it. <laughs> everyone who's got everyone who has channel uh, channel uploads as well as um, stream announcements has been pinged like fifteen times. <clears throat> okay. It's still, yeah, one, it's still one, working. Yeah, it should be completely fine because Monster Hunter barely uses any network bandwidth at all okay. because of how UDP let's, works. Let's see how this works. Also, we need to speak to the third fleet master again. Oh, yo. Oh. I already went back to Estera. Hold on. Oh, wait. I just realized I spelled Veil wrong in the titles, in the, in the, the thing. Ah, I just realized that I made fun of the Coral Highlands, but we're in the Rotten Vale. Hold on, let me change that. The Vaughn the 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 Vaughn Rail. <laughs> that that sounds like a a Honkai Star Rail knockoff or crossover or something. Isn't Honkai uh, what's it called? Uh, an RPG, like a turn-based RPG? I. Don't know. Only it's, know the I think, Star Rail is the same as like. I uh, think Genshin it's it's Impact. made by the same people who did, uh, Genshin. Genshin, yeah. You can tell it is because it's literally the same art design. Remember when we remember when we tried to say that Genshin Impact was better than Breath of the Wild? I mean, it is if you ignore no, the No, not anymore. Not anymore. <laughs> It's not better well, than Breath of the Wild because Breath of the Wild isn't filled with pr it, Breath of the Wild doesn't have a community of pedophiles. Touche. And also the doesn't have microtransactions. Oh, should I put Okay, for game title on YouTube, should I put Monster Hunter World, Monster Hunter World Iceborne, or Monster Hunter World Iceborne Master Edition? Uh <laughs> 
Huh? I guess Iceborn would fit this more. Why the hell is it different? I have it's no still idea. still just Monster Hunter. The only difference is that they're DLCs. And what the hell is Master Edition? I think Master Edition is literally just... The version of Monster Hunter... Uh, Monster Hunter where it has like, all of like, the other packs too. Like, outfit packs and stuff. Alright, everything is still working. I'm just gonna continue. I've been recording for an hour. So if you are just now joining the stream... On my end... Uh, you'll get the other error, uh, like, tomorrow, I guess. But, uh, I mean, yeah. It's still, it's worth... still working good. It's been going for six, almost seven minutes, and nothing has happened. Worst case scenario, you just have to bump the, the resolution down to 720p. Or I can just lower the bitrate, too. I mean, would it even matter if I look? What if I lower the bit? uh, what if I... Lower the resolution and higher the bitrate to 2,000. Uh, that would... Would that be would... pushing it? Yes. Okay, then I'm, I'm, just, I'm just not going to touch it then. This is working. I might have to change it for when we're doing Into the Radius. Now is because the I completely doubt <laughs> this setting will work with Into the Radius. Which, by, oh. the, way, which by the way, Into the Radius got an update guys so we'll be doing that soon you hopefully get into the radius you need to get into the radius uh, if you want to play with me get two even though into the radius two is kind of the multiplayer is kind of buggy uh anyways this is the only issue i'm completely unsure how the audio setup works with my vr headset nowadays because, like, when I plug in my VR headset, my computer doesn't immediately recognize it as another audio device. It, it, it thinks that it's a normal-ass speaker, so it tries to blast it at full volume. And also doesn't quite understand how Discord works. Uh, um, I... Well, are you using your your headset as headphones, too? N no, I, I physically can't. It's about Windex. Okay, because I usually... Because I have a, a Quest, too. And I usually put my headphones over it. Well, the Quest 2 literally is the bring your own headphone device. The Valve Index has even one built the, in already. Even though the headphones on the Quest 2 are really good, somehow. Like, when I first used it, it felt like I, even, I had headphones on. But then, I realized I didn't. <laughs> Anyways. Because R&D. Anyways, are you Anyways. right? Are you ready to descend in, into the depths of the Rotten Vale? The part. Sure. First, first we'll see if we can spot Zora Magnet Rose's trail from the, from thin air. If we find anything promising, we'll look for a safe place to drop you two off. Well then, off we go. Oh boy, time to use Homer Nulberry. Time to see if streaming actually works. Because I want to stream for you guys. But it's just been a struggle. It's a linguine. I think what I'm going to do, honestly... Oh. Is I'm gonna record the stream as well, and tomorrow uh, after the stream, I'll upload the better quality version. Those things look disgusting. They look so free. So, what's the bottom of the veil like? <laughs> I could not say. Though we have learned much, what we have are mere facts, and not a single clue to what truth they add up to. We know Zora Magdaros is heading there, but why? I'm surprised she the hasn't. She didn't come back and rise. To us. Yeah, and delicious Ooh. mysteries to consume. The third fleet master. <laughs> she looked like she'd fit right in. I mean, isn't the whole thing in Rise that, um, hmm. Kimura is, like, 
in a completely different part of the new world that no one really cared about. Let's set it down. I don't know. I don't know the story of Rise at all. Oh no. Is there even a story besides yeah, Fight Monster? Yeah, there is. Every Monster Hunter has a story. I just don't pay attention. <laughs> As I thought. Oh, oh. I'm having trouble paying attention to this story. The new story is literally simple as things are moving to the new world. You want to know why? Quick, give it more time. I want, I want like oh, Eon or Armor. We have disturbed its hunting grounds. Well, I'm sorry, I don't know what the Legiana is. Linguini, lasagna armor. Yeah, there we go. We should regroup. It, the armor used by the Italian mafia. <clears throat> oh, right, you're still in the cutscene. No, I'm done. Hmm. Oh. So much for making it down. That lo that lo uh, loathsome monster is known as Legiana. Uh, it rules all over the monsters in, in these skies. So long as it's out there hunting, we won't be able to reach the bot the base of the Rotten Veil. Vale. Oh, I had almost forgotten that <laughs> I almost forgotten that you're the no. Hold on. I had almost forgotten that you're the protagonist. <laughs> do, do, you, do you not see this giant ass sword on you my need back? To, you need to do everything for us. I suppose it wouldn't be too much trouble to ask you to hunt the Legiana before we, not, before we get knocked out of the sky again. The Legiana wasn't even, like, troubling us, honestly. Right. It was just there collecting food. Counting on you. Yeah, I don't know why it would bother. I, from what they can remember, Legiana is neutral until you attack it. Actually, what kind of armor do we have? I think my next armor set is going to be Legiana. Linguini. Pizza, pasta. Put it in the box. Your awesome armor looks really cool, though. Also, we might... I would recommend going for a set of Juras. Because Wait, I... Wait, what? I would recommend going for a set of Juras armor. It has a, a fluvial expert. Oh. Meaning nullifies damage from a, flu, a fluvia and reduces the damage from acids. That'd be that'd be doing quests in the Rotten Vale so much easier. What we got? What we got for long swords? Uh, only the the pants have a, a fluvial expert. Really, only the pants? Yeah. Can I make just the pants then? I can't. I I do need to. Upgrade my armor. I've been using fucking what bone armor this entire time, and it's like, why? Really? You've been using only bone armor? Yeah. That is thirty-one defense. Bro, have you heard of the fact that um? Just don't get hit. <laughs> yeah. I I'm not even joking. That's what I've been doing this entire time, just not getting hit. Yeah, but nah, but seriously, like, look at, look at the Jiros armor, honestly. Yeah, Palico Rally, Paralysis Resistance, Horn Maestro, Paralysis Attack. Paralysis, eh. I think you want the Lumu armor for just normal damage, because it has Affinity on there. Because Affinity is good for Longsword, like, really There's good. also Master Mounter, too, on Lumu. And windproof? Eh, windproof is kind of okay. I would say... We I, will need windproof up the, up the ass when we start fighting Kushala. B blind cider? What is that? It improves the effectiveness 
of flash attacks and items. Sleep resistance. Rathian armor is also really good. It has health boost on the helm. Yeah, I've gone 16 minutes and nothing's happened. So yeah. I think I think 175 is good. I'm not going to go for armor right now. I kind of want main episodes to be like continuing the game and then we can just do our we can do our equipment off screen. Or maybe in other episodes, I guess, I don't know. Ooh, the Titsu Yaku longsword. Or Titsy. I keep, I keep saying Titsu, but there's no you. Well, I mean, to be fair, it's a completely made up name. Yeah, but it's Titsy Yaku, not Titsu. Oh, Titsu Yaku. Hey, yo. Hmm. God damn it. Hornitar? Why is there no cafeteria in the third fleet ship thing? I have no idea. I mean, to be fair, there is one in the main camp. Where'd you go? Wait, where'd you post a quest? Uh, po just posted a hey, quest. Partner. Slow and careful. Oh, she still does it? Okay. I don't know why, when I tried to- Oh, by the way, uh, holding R when she's pulling out the book makes it go faster. I know. Okay, I- 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 I knew that was a thing, I just couldn't remember how to do it. Oh, those pressing start as well. Okay. Ah, <sighs> how's my equipment actually? Hold on. Nice and basic. Or, hold on, wait, do I have the health booster? Oh, we have a pendant, I forgot. Oh yeah, I forgot about that, hold on. <clears throat> I'm bringing a health booster, you can keep your ghillie mantle if you want. I never used the ghillie mantle. It's good if you need a quick heal and you don't want to get smacked. Oh my god, I need to I need to craft a gigaton of stuff. Hold on. Potion. Amount to craft. Yes. Just yes. Oh wait, high metal. Hold on. Do I have the high metal stuff? I think I do. Oh, I don't have the leggings. Can I make the leggings? You could say you don't have the Legiana. That was terrible. <laughs> that was I can! Point. I look so fat. My god, my thighs. <laughs> well, I'm empty. All right, flash pods. Alright. I think I'm ready. Okay. I have Trank Bombs now, so just in case you want to catch this fine pasta. We can try. I don't have traps. I might- I'd have to grab them real quick. We need to clear the way so we can- I'll grab my traps. Hold on. The airship will get knocked out of the sky if we don't do something about that monster. Will it? Like, it didn't really- it didn't even go for us. 
No, no, there it goes. It's literally the same energy as like, hey, you there walk goes my internet. You might want to decrease it a little bit then. <sighs> God damn Cause I, it. Because it's, it, I think it's literally just because of Monster Hunter being too beautiful. 1500. Let's try. Let's see, hold on. You'll need to probably change from VBR to CBR. I think I'm on CBR. Yeah, no, I'm on CBR. Okay, then uh, then it, it should be fine if you, if you wait a little bit for it to stabilize. It just disconnected? It's not stabilizing. <laughs> You're walking in place? Can you not? Yeah, no, it's not I, working at all. I didn't know I could even do that while you're in a menu. It's disconnecting over and over. It lit it only does that when I'm in... It literally started doing that when I went into the field. Dude, stop streaming. Yeah, no, it 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 started it started doing this when I went into the field. Which would probably imply that it's trying to compress things too much. And because of that your computer itself is exploding. I think I Okay, no, it's... OBS, uh, OBS. Uh, Discord keeps going down to red. Am I still a robot? Not anymore. Yeah, it just, it just keeps going back down to red. Yeah, I think things are fine. What if I did 1,200? <laughs> God damn. What if I tried 1,200? I'm still recording, so I still have a, a decently quality VOD to upload. Alright, let's try. I'm at 1,200. My god, it's like probably- you can probably smell the pixels on my stream. I mean, that's not necessarily how that works. Uh, it just makes it so that you just buffer every now and again. Whenever I- whenever I move, it just gets all pixelated though. That's what- that's what I've seen. Oh, right, because that's also the different mind. Yeah, look, okay, brain. Okay. Let's see. Let's start, let's try and play. You can smell the pickles. I'm at 1,200. If it, if it keeps doing this, I'm just not going to stream. Which is sad. Sadage. All right, let's see. Let's let's try. Also, I think we went to the wrong camp. It's it's best to go to the other one. Well, I don't have the other one unlocked. Oh, I need a do I. 
Damn it. Oh, yeah, there it goes. Well, dang. It's like literally the second I start moving. What the hell? The second I start actually gaming is when it goes down. I don't understand. And it's fine with um with into the radius sometimes. No, that no, this this wasn't this wasn't happening during into the radius. I didn't I didn't have this problem when I was playing into the radius. So yeah, no, I just I just can't stream. There there has to be a setting. There has to be. Stream server? I mean, you could always just Go to the 720p. How do I? I'd have to. I mean, I'm, I am at 1920. I'd, ha I'd have to stop the recording. Yeah, it's whatever. The resolution is gonna help because it's like i don't know it's like the actual connection to the router is what's doing this not like whatever let's just see i mean if it's the connection to the router itself then nothing will help yep no there it goes It's all the way down to zero. God damn it. So yeah, I just can't stream anymore because fuck my family. Yeah, that just sounds like your router just flat out doesn't want anything to do with anything. It's only me though. Like, my, my switch works fine. Like, the, the freaking, like, my brother's Xbox works fine. I forgot to eat. The reason why that works fine is literally because um, live streaming is obviously very, very real time. There can be latency added into any game and no one will be none the wiser. I forgot to eat, so I'm back at camp. I just don't know where the linguine is. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I, so yeah, just streaming is just done for me apparently, and no one cares. It was fun while it lasted. I mean, it might be fine if you stream, like, Pokemon. No! I can't- I tried streaming Minecraft and it did this. But you see, Minecraft is a game that has quality put into it. And you think Pokemon's gonna be any better? Yes, it has pop and it should be fine. Not all Pokemons. I'm talking about specifically Scarlet and Violet. I mean, if your if your stream dies when playing a 2D game, then you're screwed. It never it never used to do this. There, there's has to be either something wrong with that router that no one's seeing. Or it just doesn't like my computer. And I'm gonna have to just either not stream, keep make the channel upload only, or buy my own internet. Which is gonna be expensive, but 
That's going to be the only way I'm going to be able to stream. I forgot where the legion in this is. It's at the very top of the, uh, the thing. I I'm pretty sure if I, if I even tell, if I told them, hey, this isn't letting me do this, they'll be like, I'm sorry, but we don't know, how to, we don't know what's wrong. It works for us. Cool. It works for you, not for me. Is the Legion even up here? That's the, uh, that's the issue with having parents that are technologically illiterate. It works for us. I don't know what's going on. And then they just don't do anything. Yeah, no, Legion is here. Where the fuck is... Where is the Legiana? We wasted thir we wasted like 15 minutes looking for this thing. Well, more like we wasted 15 minutes trying to figure out how to unscrew your, your computer. I don't even know where I am anymore. I don't know where the Legiana is. Maybe the Legiana was the friend we made along the way. The Legiana was the Legiana we made along the way. Here's where Puke Puke usually exploits everything. Oh, I'm tracking the monster. I see it. like the router or if it's like the connection on my computer so that's the it, thing probably a combination of both because usually in houses especially between floors there's going to be a, at least a decent amount of like bar and whatnot and not just flat out blocks and gonna connect i mean it did say that Two is like weak, but it's good for going through walls. But do you know if you're connected to the 2.4 gigahertz or the 5 gigahertz band? It said two on my computer. Okay, then it might just be your computer itself. Something may be failing, I don't know. It's been, my computer has been working fine for, for a while. But I don't know. There's no way I can change it from my computer, right? Uh, there is, but I'm not entirely sure how to do that because I haven't done it in a while. We can cut uh, its tail off. You can. I, I, you can? Because I've tried for a while with greatsword and nothing happened. You can do it much easier with longsword. I was wailing on this guy's tail with greatsword. I don't know if you can. I've done it before. Ah, stop giving me Freaking ice light, holy baloney sandwich. I just can't do much of anything because no all because you know attacks require a lot of stamina. Maybe I can 
sneak the, uh, the gigahertz thing when everyone's asleep. If I figure it how if I figure it out how to change it on the thing, I'll I will do it. I don't care. I mean, I mean worst case scenario, it just doesn't work, and I change it back. Oh, you bitch! Get away from her, you bitch! What were you saying? Worst case scenario, um. It's just like not activated. Oh, Vespoid! Because, like, you, it has to be a separate network, technically speaking, in order for that to work. Unless your computer is smart enough to automatically, uh, to, to shut up. Shut, shut <laughs> up. I said the C word. Oh, you're down there. Oh. I, I thought... I thought... I thought it was going up. Same. We're getting distracted with computer... I, I need to figure this out after the stream. Because this is pissing me off. I really want to stream, but this is, like, preventing me to. tail enough it should have came off. Oh you know what? I may have been thinking of Namiel's tail. I think you can only break it. You can't slice it. True for most flying creatures in this game. No. <laughs> you would I think with you would think with Legiana you'd be able to cut its tail off. Uh, I mean, look at it. Well, yeah, but like some monsters, like it would kind of screw with their animation. I would think, right? Not really. It would just make the fight different. Please hit the hit freaking stop bouncing. I miss. Oh, I'm at I'm at orange. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Was that a bomb pod? Powerful type no. of slinger ammo? No, that was just that was just my my uh my back. Oh. I didn't hear it I didn't hear anything go up. All I heard was just a Well if you one tap the discharge it just kind of set a little bit of a poof. I'm gonna after after this I'm gonna try and see if I can if I can change it from my computer. 
I'm gonna Google this now. I, I, I don't remember now. Hold on. Underworld. What, Legiana's tail? Yes. Okay, ah! so it's only breakable. I thought you were look I thought you were googling the, the Wi-Fi thing. I was like, why are you doing that now? <laughs> I forgot I had ice light. Oh, she's limping. Capture, capture, capture. Capture. I don't have traps. You I thought you did. Traps. I have trank. Oh wait, I have traps. Ow. Uh, 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 uh. Get over here. Get your ass over here. There we go. Oh. Because I already tranked it twice. Oh. <laughs> I was about to say, like, what now the hell? Can get to the base of the rotten veil. All right. Come on. Uh, it's funny if, if trapping it using a taser killed it. My character looks like they're going to a phase. I got a plate. Same. Yeah, network ban 2.4 gigahertz. Why are you all? Why do you always start talking with dots, lady? Because mysterious How and ma magical. You truly are impressive. Now our airship will make it to uh, its descent into the lower depths of the Rotten Vale. <laughs> Just say the word when you're ready. All right, the time has come. Let's head down to the bottom of the Vale. You know what I wish more games did? If you get a hundred percent completion, you get to hear the bloopers of all of the voice actors. I wish my voice actors sent me bloopers, but they don't. That'd be hilarious. Yeah, like you can make that an Easter egg. I wish they did, but I don't think they keep them, which is upsetting. I mean, it makes sense because, well, I'm paying. I'm paying for it, but like, yeah. I'd love to hear yeah. the bloopers. Blooping. Uh, I gotta, hold on. Items, I think I'm fine. Or is there high rank Vespoid armor? There should be. Now is the high time. rank ingot. <clears throat> there should be high rank all armor. Oh, I guess it's because the technically speaking, the high rank best for would be a, uh, would be Hornetari, right? I guess I don't know. Oh, I'm going to have to do command. I'm not doing that on stream. I'm going to have to do command prompts and stuff. I think. 
Well, actually, hold on. Second. Network and settings, select Wi Fi. I'm at the uh, the lady, by the way. I know, but I need to to check on my plants. Oh yeah, I should probably do that too. Growing uh -oh. some herb. Oh hey, we unlocked the melding pot. Yeah, it's not really that useful. I mean, for right I now, mean... it's not. It, it, it is in, in uh, later high rank and master rank. Yeah, because we have a bunch of shit <laughs> to just toss in there. I Scroll mean, to related settings and click on change adapter. I Where's... mean, it kind of... I'm going to be honest, melding is kind of a little better here in world than it is in Rise. I don't see related settings. Where would that be? Yeah, I have no idea. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna do this off, off screen. Oh. Hello. Hello. Oh. Why? <laughs> Because blowfish or pufferfish or whatever oh. it's called. <laughs> you know what that apparently is the sound of what the fugu pufferfish can make when it dies, right? That noise? Yeah. I still don't understand why people eat fugu. I don't know what fugu is. It is a, what is it? It's a, like a tradition, like ancient Japanese sushi dish using the most dangerous fish in the world named fugu. If it's not prepared correctly, even when you cook it, um, which they usually don't, it'll be filled with deadly neurotoxins that would make GLaDOS blush. Damn. You all good? Like, it causes death within a few seconds, so I don't know what people even eat it. Hey. I mean, in order for anyone to even prepare it, they have to be licensed and whatnot, but, um, humans still make mistakes even when they're trained. Anyways, third fleet master. Actually, I say we do some optionals so that we upgrade our stuff. Oh, okay. Turn into the rotten veil and let me know. We have a couple of things we can do. Yeah, I just mainly, I just mainly need a lot of monster bone pluses because I found a, a set of armor that I want. It's the gala outfit. Oh my god. What is a JoJo reference? All right. <laughs> oh. It's just, it's just basically, I forget his name entirely. It was, it, it was kind of a thing. In, There's a in lot of JoJo uh, Easter eggs or events in Monster Hunter, apparently. There's a I lot mean, of, there's a, there's a lot of, there's a few uh, Baki Easter eggs too. What the hell? Wait, why would there be Baki Easter eggs? It's a collaboration, I think. Oh. Right. Let's see what optionals we have. We have, uh, we have things from, uh, from LR3, 4, and 5. Let's get these over with, I guess. I need some friggin' coffee. 
But I don't want coffee because if I get coffee, I won't be able to sleep for the next 90 years. You know, there was a point where, uh, during high school, I physically could not get enough coffee to stay awake. Same. Like, not during high school, just now. Like, <laughs> if I tried to, I would actually be at risk of a heart attack. Weak. <laughs> imagine not, imagine not being able to take enough caffeine that you die. Couldn't be me. <laughs> Just joking. Bro, you're you're liable to to have a heart attack as well. Nah, I'm fine. I'm living. The monster energy drink uh, mascot creeps up from behind you. We don't. We. I'm a gamer. I don't die. I respawn. Hmm. <laughs> That's what everyone said before that one just funny haha -ha on Area 51. Yeah, and you know what happened? All those people Naruto running. <laughs> they just respawned in their bed. You know that it got to the point where people didn't get the joke and actually thought that they were going to do that. What, respawn in their bed? Yes. Oh my god. Um... Now the thing is, Area 51, since they got, you know, big warning beforehand, they're gonna be just a shitload of idiots outside. Um... If anyone went past that line, it was just a felony trespassing. The heck? Ordin ordinarily, it shoot on shoot, shoot the kill on sight. I, I did it's... not know this little area was here. Uh, uh. But yeah, like freaking what? Did, I don't know what they expected. Raiding Area Fifty One. I mean, what actually happened with that? It was literally just like Burning Man, but outside of Area Fifty One. Because they only shoot you if you go past a certain line. I'm pretty sure a lot of people went past that line. They probably did, but because, you know, it was a huge event and everything, they were like, you know what, let's not shoot to kill just in case of collateral. Let's just fall in them. Which, to the people that actually probably did go past, um, what the hell were you thinking? You just got a fun on this for no reason. I just saw Toby just poke you. It's fine. It was a love tap. How do you unlock these, by the way? Do you just capture every monster? Uh, I don't know. Because I remember, I like, like, y you can... You can get these by just capturing monsters, I know. Because I captured a Rathian last night, and then I got one. I think what it is is that when you increase the, uh, research level on these guys, uh, options pop up. Ah, oh, you just had to flinch him. Sorry. For some reason, Flip X is really good at that. I mean, you you have a gigantic axe. What do you expect? Yeah, but like, not even Charge Break can do this as well. God damn it, stay still! Ow. That I call Cap. He ran directly into the blade. Okay, that did not hit me. I said call Cap. Hey! I just poked this his freaking four leg and he's like, no, my leg. Oh, 
Hold on to your carpet. Matt's gonna miss. Ow. You jerk, I couldn't sharpen. Toby, oh, I need to sharpen too. Now you see why in Drive I always carry a great wet trick with me. I don't remember if they're even in this game, to be honest. I think they are. Okay, sure, Nair, sure. Sure. I'm s I still want to watch you play Generations Ultimate. At some point. Like, it's gonna- it's gonna be weird seeing you play an old world game. There's gonna be a lot of stuff you're not used to. Whenever I hear old world, I always think of Europe, and so I'm going to- I, I'm just gonna pretend that as soon as I load up the Generation Ultimate and play a, a round, you're gonna hear a monster go, hip hip cheerio, like what the fuck is gonna do. That would be funny if there was a British monster. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, did you just throw a rock at him? I just killed him by throwing a rock at him. <laughs> <laughs> I chucked a rock in his face and he died. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, wait. Okay. No! Uh, I, I did. <laughs> he, he did the equivalent of like what all the heroes do when they're trying to protect their friends, just jumping the way the projectile. <laughs> Mr. President, get down! No. <laughs> <laughs> Too soon. Or I get- I, I actually- I think it- it's probably fine now, actually. It's been a while. Oh, well, am I gonna get- well, I guess. I just- am I gonna get banned? I'm not streaming, so no, I'm not. <laughs> and I can always edit that out. Am I going to remember? No. <laughs> I mean, you probably can get me banned. Oh, yeah, that's true. Whoops. I mean, it's probably fine, as long as we don't say anything too specific. Mm, I'm just joking. <laughs> I mean, keep, you... in, keep in mind, you can get banned just by sounding like a freaking celebrity. Remember? Huh? Someone got someone got cop uh someone got copyrighted by their voice sounding like a uh, a singer. Well, that's the stupidest thing ever. I thought you heard of it. I thought it was that they got their voice copyright claimed because uh someone didn't like them. Cause I saw that where it's like it was just one person who didn't like this one streamer. So I'm gonna copyright claim him for his voice and get him taken down. Uh, Copyright on YouTube is broken. Like you're just now wanted... finding it out. No, no, I'm just coming to terms with it because it means that if I really wanted to, I could just claim that that you're stealing content from me because that you're playing games with me, and YouTube will go, "Well, yep, you're right." People have tried to copyright strike others for. Uh... Reaction videos, and by and by that I mean the reaction video person is copyright striking someone else. That is dumb. I know. <laughs> like legally speaking, 
that all assuming that it's actually a transformative work that all falls under fair use no 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 the person who is reacting i Cop know yeah that the point literally still stands yeah but that's still they're copyright striking someone someone else for for something that's not even their work exactly so even before the free use argument um you don't even own the copyright to that thing in the first place to set the hell down but youtube doesn't really care about fair use you want to join a thing i did not hear the bell ring hold on we're finding baroth oh I forgot to put a voucher on this. Well, shit. You can just leave and put it on. It's not even worth it. It's only 2500 Touche. Oh. That's an oversight. Hmm. I entirely forgot that the Palumu... Switch Axe upgrades from the Jirotoda Switch Axe, technically. Oh, you got rid of your Jirotoda Axe. Yeah, I'm uh, going to have to make a new one. Do you have parts? Oh. Uh, I mean, I have mine, so you don't have to worry about... Do you have a fire? I don't think I do. Because if you have fire... We can take care of both of his weaknesses. I mean, I... Okay, no, I don't have Jirotodith parts. Um, Do you have a fire axe? Uh, no. Damn. I have to go... I have to get a bear off in order to get Anginus. Oh, I can upgrade to Jirotodith, uh, plus plus. With my longsword. Uh, in order to get the question mark, question mark, question mark, third tree, which I am going to just say is most likely Rathalos. You I can have you to... can still wish list that that weapon, by the way. I keep forgetting the wish list exists. Hold on. Uh, the why? There we go. I hit the wrong button. God damn it. Ooh, I want Legiana. Oh, I'm gonna have to get another Toby sword to get Legiana. That's hmm. one thing I really wish they did differently. What every at the beginning of every tree, you have the option to forge directly to the beginning of that tree. That's how old Monster Hunter used to be. Like every monster, every monster that you fight, it. You can just immediately make their weapon. I mean, that's kind of the case with this sometimes. Like, it depending on depending on how far you go, you can just skip right to a strong weapon that they have. But it feels like it's kind of pseudo random. Not really. You can kind of tell which ones they are. Yeah, you, yeah, like the like the weapons that have a thick border around them in the tree, those ones you can you can craft directly on them. The yeah, ones, but like it, the ones that don't, but, yeah. But like from for what I'm seeing with switch, I like it's like kind of haphazardly placed which ones you can and which ones you can't. Yeah, well, I want I want le I need I need a single leggy on a claw. And then I can make the the leggy on a longsword. Right. What's the next best thing for bear off? The only the only thing is that if I get that leggy on a longsword, I'm gonna have to fight more Jirotodas. Uh. Ice. We don't have ice. Not yet. I just go. Uh... I I just I, bleh, I guess just go for damage. Or. Do you have poison? No. Yeah, just go for damage. 
For some reason, I don't, I don't even have a, a neutral damage thing, cause well, I just forgot that to upgrade that kind of path. I guess bone axe too. Let's see what happens there. Ooh. You know, you know how I, how, uh, when you have, like, uh, uh, I guess a footrest underneath your dress, you tend to naturally put your foot on it? Like the, the metal bar underneath my desk that I'm currently putting my feet on to? <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. the footrest underneath my desk is my computer itself. That's not good. <laughs> It, it, it's fine, as long as I don't go too far to the right, it won't turn off, because I won't <laughs> hit the power button actually. Have you ever turned it off with your foot? Yes, on accident. I th <laughs> actually, time. I think you've done it on uh, with us before. Yes, yes I have. Um, but my foot is over the heat vent. I can now see why my computer was dying during the Magnaros. It is so goddamn hot that it's borderline uncomfortable to even put my foot on it anymore. Right. Ready. Almost like if, if it's almost like a computer to get hot. Why am I so used to how this is set up and rise? I'm so used to just over here being the ultimate fear bird. I I don't like the spirit birds at all. I really don't. It's not even that like I'm I'm too lazy to to go grab them. I just think I just think Going out and just collecting spirit birds is boring. Like it, it to me, it's just a way to force the player to explore the map, rather than them doing it on their own. Well, I mean, it does make sense considering you that the, dick. Considering that the cornerstone of Riot is that you're supposed to use the environment to your advantage. Yeah, but. That's just Monster Hunter. But like In every quarter, Monster Hunter, you use the vi environment to your advantage. They put some giga imprint on it. You use you use the environment to your advantage in the world. You don't necessarily have to. In Rise, it sometimes feels like you, you don't have, have to in Rise either. It, to me, though, it feels like, you, like it feels like you I just landed in, in the poop. Unless you're a pro, unless you're a pro gamer, which you are. Rise is just like I don't know. I don't like Rise as much as World. Bro, I call cap. about how the maps are gonna be in, in wilds. Because if you if you look at the um if you look at the trailers, like it's absolutely massive. It's making me think that wilds is gonna be completely open world. It would be cool actually, but also my Th that would be like an game. actual like hunting simulator at that point. Watch how you have to like track certain monsters by using like real life hunting tactics. Because some monsters are play team regardless. Like I think they're trying like before with Moss Owner, it used to just be like an arcadey like boss rush type of game. But ever since World came out, they've tried to go as, as immersive as possible. 
Monster Hunter VR. You said that before, and I said I know. I'm gonna say the same thing. That sounds awful. <laughs> what about Monster Hunter Super Reality? Monster Hunter Now. That's that isn't that an actual thing? That's a mo that's the mobile game. Exactly. <laughs> That's the Pokemon Go version of Monster Hunter. It's made by it's it's even made by the same people in Niantic. Is it also made a Sonic Pokemon Go like game? For some reason? I for it's like in Japan only. So what's the point? Sonic isn't really that good at making mobile games. I mean, look at look at Dream Team. Dream Team isn't the mobile game. It's yeah, it is. Game. Yes, it is. It's an Apple game. What, yeah, what is what is the iPhone? It does. It's not necessarily on the iPhone. It's only on the iPad and the I made the iPhone. <laughs> I remember when Frieza killed Eggman. <laughs> You're roboting, hold on. Ow. What was it? What did Eggman kill Frieza? Yeah, no, Eggman threw a, uh, a Nokia at Frieza, my bad. Where's the tail? I like how you finished them like they do in every anime with the swordsman. Wow, wait, his his tail is like right next to it. I never understood this. Why in every single anime that has a dude with a katana that he has to be some kind of like brooding, edgy, like, mysterious man that's able to barely move his sword and half the plan is cut in half. Like, why? It's what leads to people thinking that a katana can be a modern-day military tank. Of course, it, of course it can. According to my enemy. Even though realistically, uh, how it was in history, the only thing that a katana could actually beat was a musket. And it wasn't even really the katana, it was their armor. Paper armor is really powerful against flying rocks. I thought you were gonna say flying wyverns. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, I wouldn't be surprised if there's a joke armor that's basically just. Paper yeah, the, the, armor. The, the completed thing is silver, meaning that there's still another three star monster that we haven't fought in the uh, the arena. Oh my god, there's a lot of four-star stuff we've never have done. Oh god. Let's do something easy. This this thing this this one ups our uh, upgrades our uh botanist. Or botanist. Bot botanist. Bot 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 bottom. What a bottle. <laughs> yeah, but nah, this thing this thing upgrades the the botanist. Are you from... Are you from South England? Are you from South England? Because what a bottle. I still find it funny how... Like... The British... A lot of them can barely speak English correctly. Yet they were the ones that invented the language, so I guess technically we're the ones that aren't speaking it correctly. 
It's just funny to me. Alright, we gotta fight. We gotta kill some Hornetars. Oh no, the strongest enemy in the game. Exactly, How stronger than ever... Fatalis. <laughs> How will we ever survive? What? Why are you pinging? Um, so I'm pretty sure it happens whenever you just encounter a target. No. Because it's just ha I'm not doing anything, it's just kind of happening. How are you pinging? Like, what? I literally am doing nothing at all. Left trigger. Equip. Right trigger? That's, okay, that's how you do it. Are you able to capture Hornetar? No. Oh. Actually, we should probably be using a clutch claw for this. Do you want to carve him? Yes. Oh, I killed a crow in accident. Hold on. The signal used to be really helpful in the previous games. Also, I saw a meme on Reddit where it's like people were complaining that Monster Hunter Rise is too easy because you can just wire bug away and heal. And then someone showed a video of them in Generations Ultimate just walking through lo a loading zone with the monster cap all of them through it. Rise is not even with the wire bug. You can literally just get on your dog and heal while running. You can sharpen while running. Yeah, but you see, it's not as egregious as just leaving the monster in another loading zone altogether. Yeah, but still. That doesn't make but... it any less easier. True. Oh, alright. Apparently using Scatternut still kills him. I mean, what did you expect? You're still basically shooting a bullet at them. Any more? Not. That's what you get. glad that I decided to remove that one mod that changes the uh, ending theme because I will be copyright claimed up the ass. What was the ending theme? Uh, it was Guts' theme from Berserk. Yes. You know that apparently people actually want a re-remake of Berserk. Just go watch someone play Elden Ring. There you go. But you see, uh, you don't have a buff guy shouting Griffith for three years. However, you do just have Dark Souls, either way. Oh, now we 
got another thing, I think. Like a second botanist thingy. Botanist. Botania. Botanist. So now I can start growing adamant seeds. Why would you even need that? You're to raise my officers. defense? Have you heard uh... of not getting hit? <laughs> yeah, but, like, it's still good to have, my dude. Well, you see, real men just die. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Either way, like, there's still a really good, uh, money source. I remember, uh, before, the way to get a lot of money was just to get, was just to grow a bunch of, uh, Grow a bunch of, uh, mite seeds and then sell them. My man is doing a Ponzi scheme. <laughs> right, let's go, let's cap, let's capture a Palumu. Wait, what? You cut out there. Let's capture a Palumu. Okay. What is Palumu week to? Fire. Oh, well, fuck me then. Hold on. Assault Axe Plus, which oh. is just pure damn. You want to guess? Also, have paralysis. God, this axe looks like it. I'm just wearing a rack of ribs. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's. <laughs> That's, um. That's that's uh, that's Baroth's uh, equipment set for you. This look, might be my look. last hunt for tonight. I yeah, do, your I do just is... I do just want to chill. And your internet is also having a seizure. Again? Okay, it's fixed now. Yeah, I, I just want to chill for the rest of the night, and I do have to like, I do have to do a, an episode of uh, Persona. Like, uh, an episode or two. I still don't have Trank Bombs. That reminds me. I need Sleep I... Herbs, that's the problem. Slurb. Slurb. Uh, I don't have any more slurbs either, Walshite. Cool. <sighs> I think it's this way, actually. Oh! You're right there! Alright. Oh, hi. Oh, and you're gone. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> he just he just saw a storm. I up hit and him like, nope. once and he left. Watch your jet, man. Watch your jet. Your... 
Imagine missing that jump to that vine. I did that multiple times. It's it okay. I mean, like, in person. Like, not even as a monster owner. Oh, you would just die. That'd be terrifying. Rawr. Remember, this is a capture. Yeah, well, you see, um... Where in the Geneva Convention? One of the Geneva checklist. <laughs> Thanks, Azrael. <laughs> Look, okay, I forgot I was still targeting the monster. I was confused as to why I couldn't move the camera. I'm going to break the fucking left stick, I swear to god. Huh? I spam the left stick to get out of the status. Oh, whoops. I hit good I hit good work rather than first aid. <laughs> oh god. I'm stunned! No Ow, it sat on me. You think that would actually be soft, but no. I don't think its butt is soft. I think its neck is soft. Its butt looks like it's full of scales. Could be soft scales, like a lizard. I've never felt a lizard, so I wouldn't know. Here's where you remembered that I grew up in Florida. <laughs> <laughs> Crocodiles. <laughs> Close enough. <laughs> they're just big lizards, big puppies. I mean, they're technically small dinosaurs, so... <laughs> where are you going? <laughs> he, he just fucking did a ground pound off of the edge of the stage. He was lots of stock. I just remembered my output for the video is gonna be uh, uh 720. I, I forgot to change it back. Well, one half is gonna be 1080, the other half's gonna be 720. Oh, thanks. <laughs> that was totally planned. <laughs> We might want to simmer down. Ah, I missed. Mm. 
limping. Got it. Keep hitting it with training. <laughs> we hit it at the same time. <laughs> okay. Do you have the lighter fluid? The what? The lighter fluid. The light. Are we gonna set Palumu on fire? Yes. It's not a war crime if it's the first time. <laughs> One thing I don't understand is, how are we getting monster bones by capturing the monster? We take out its feet. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. I mean, hey, it wasn't using it anyways. Hello. It's still alive, of course it's still using it. Eh. What else do no, we have? I'm not, no I'm not law. posing a quest, I just want to see what else. There's no loss against it. Uh, we have a hunt up. We have a, an arena with a Palumu. Yeah, see, we capture it and then we immediately kill it. it would be right. funny if if there actually was like a Monster Hunter Geneva convention that says you couldn't do this to a monster. Like a Monster Hunter Peter. Uh, no, Peter still kills an animal for no reason. I think that's it for for right now. Thank you for joining us. I'll see you next time. Goodbye. Bye.